what you need to know about your heart and potassium. Okay, it's Richard and I just got my cardio results back from the doctor here. I was actually at his office and uh, good news is my heart is great. Okay, my heart is good. It's, it's pumping, uh, everything's working along fine and my blood is good. Uh, so I'm all good to go for my eye surgery. But here's the fact that you need to know and especially you runners, people who exercise about potassium. I've been taking potassium for the last two months on the advice of uh, somebody who runs a lot and says, well, if you sweat a lot, you need a lot of potassium, right? Wrong, okay? Definitely wrong. Uh, if you get enough potassium from natural sources, uh, tomatoes, uh, bananas, orange juice, oranges, uh, those kind of fruits with potassium in them, you're getting the right amount of potassium, even if you're running. I have, uh, because I've been taking potassium pills because I thought I needed it, an overload of potassium. That's my biggest risk in everything is overload of potassium. And here's another fact about potassium. It can give you faults. Uh, you can actually get faults readings, right? Uh, if you're under in potassium, if your potassium is too low, you're gonna get leg cramps and all that kind of stuff. But if your potassium is too high, you're also gonna get the leg cramp, cramps and uh, muscle spasms and stuff. So it can be from too high of potassium that you actually have those leg cramps uh, that keep you up at night or, or uh, during the day that bother you. But here's the worst part is potassium, uh, an overload of potassium will give your heart arrhythmic uh, irregular beatings, okay? It's no good for your heart. So please, before you start taking potassium, get your blood test uh, done, uh, get your levels tested at a hospital, and uh, get with your doctor or physician and get that checked before you even start on a potassium uh, uh, treatment for sweating uh, if you exercise too much. and just get them from natural sources like I have. I've been eating a lot of fruits, bananas, oranges, uh, tomatoes, tomato sauce, all that kind of good stuff. So I don't need the potassium. So for yourself, your safety, your heart, uh, the, re the feelings that you get that you think could be from potassium, maybe they're from an overload of potassium. So, and it's very unsafe for you, very, very unsafe. So. Uh, uh, get to your doctor, get your blood checked, uh, get your potassium levels checked, and uh, then, and only then, start a treatment. Uh, this is Richard from beautiful Guadalajara. I'm just about to uh, go grab a coffee and then walk the rest of the way home and hook up with my family who's here from Canada. We had breakfast at Chilaquiles, and uh, this was the only interruption. Now we're off to the farmer's market and then back to, down that way to old Guadalajara and we're gonna have a blast so uh, we're gonna talk to you later but please please if you're doing potassium get your blood checked Richard talk to you later